Hey, what's up guys? Um, so basically I forgot to record an intro to this video, which isn't surprising as the whole video is pretty botched. Um, there's no real story or order or nice transitions, but it was just a bit of a practice, you know, trying to have fun, work on my techniques. So I'm still learning a lot. I have no idea what I'm doing. But yeah, this was my trip to New York. The video is kind of meant to be about how to do New York cheap by a tourist who's never been to the city. Um, but it just kind of turned into me street drinking a lot. <laughs> um, but yeah, I hope you enjoy the video of some sort and yeah. Oh, we're in Chinatown, four dumplings, two dollars. Fresh dumplings. <laughs> What's up, what's up, what's up? I am at my favorite place in the world, the bar. It's a nice bar too. Got a cool roof. Whoa. That's a cool shot. Um, <laughs> so, I really needed to piss and my mom taught me that needing to go to the toilet is a good enough reason to go to the bar. So that's what I did. Bit early, but having a good time. Next up, I'm going to go to probably my second or one of my favorite places in the world as well. I will see you there. Yo, what's up? I'm just in Whole Foods. I've just been to the library, studied for a bit, and the 9-11, uh, 9-11, September 11 memorial. My brain's not working. People there are fucking weird. It's like, it's a memorial and it's sad and there's people like taking selfies and like, ah, shit, like, I don't get it. Um, anyway, Matt, Whole Foods, which something I love about Whole Foods is they don't tell you off a drink in the cafe area. Um, and I got something in dedication of my biggest fan, Willie's Super Brew. G'day, Billy Backler, how are ya? Uh, cool. I don't know what I'm gonna do next, but this is a tip. Drink in grocery stores. In the States, no one tells you off, really. In some states, you're allowed to. I'm like, I'm literally standing in front of... <laughs> but like, no one gives a fuck. And no one can really tell with all these hipster beers. They just look like kombucha or some shit. Um, yeah, drink in grocery stores. It's cheap and you can just go get more and more. Uh, next I'm on a cruise, maybe down to Brooklyn or something. I'll see what happens. What's up? What's up, what's up? It's actually two days later. I was um, a bit too hungover to record yesterday and too drunk the night before to finish. So um, yeah, here I am summarizing. I ended up going into um, Manhattan. Uh, I went to the Comedy Cellar, which is like the coolest comedy club ever, amazing. Uh, I was street drinking for a while before that, and then I went out drinking after. Um, woke up on the train at like 7 a.m. in Coney Island. What the fuck? Um, anyway, what was I going to say? Oh, yes. So, as a tourist, you can definitely do New York for cheap, especially for food. Food is the easiest. I mean, I think I spend like $5 on food that day, like two or three slices of pizza, and some dumplings I think I had. Split pits is a dollar a slice, dumplings are two dollars, like four. So that's cool. Uh, but you definitely wouldn't want to do that every day, you'll get scurvy or something. But I took some vitamin C, so that helps. Um, but yeah, there's lots of free stuff to do as well in New York, but obviously you want to do some stuff, but just be selective I guess. And yeah, sorry, this is kind of a shit ending. I'm a bit fucking weird at the minute, feeling a bit strange, but yeah, um, cool, bye, see ya.